opening up two different mystery boxes that were sent over here from two different Pokemon card YouTubers, but the boxes look exactly the same. And I think this is going to be a crazy video. Watch this. Cue the dramatic music. Now, make it black and white. Almost there. Okay, good, good, good. Now, show us what happens. Oh! Oh! I didn't think that! Rick Woman and the Legend Card so let's get started with our first box here. This is from Pokey Petey and Bella. And you know what? I actually read the note in here. They sent a personal note. And the first thing that Bella wanted to let me know was she wanted to give me this. And I think this is probably the coolest Pikachu I've ever seen in my entire life. And I love it so much. So thank you so much for this Pikachu. So it looks like we have a bunch of different envelopes in here. And what I want to do is I think I'm going to start to start off with number one. All right, let's open this up. Let's see what we get. Oh, is it what I think it is? Oh, oh, it is. It's a dark Sylveon V Celebrations collection box. Those are so sick. But you know what? While we're over here, you we might as well open up envelope number two and see what's in this next one here. I think it actually had a 300, but they scratched it off. But anyway, okay, this is definitely two. Here we go. And in envelope number two, Oh, we got a Fusion Strike, an Evolving Skies, and a Lost Origin. We're going to open up some of this stuff in just a second, but I also wanted to let you guys know that I want to pay it forward and give away every single item that we pull in both of these mystery boxes. So there's going to be two winners. Each person will get everything in the mystery box, besides the Pikachu, because I have strict instructions to keep that. But if you wanted to enter the giveaway, all you have to do is, number one, smash the like button. Number two, make sure you subscribe to the channel with notifications on. And then number three, leave a comment down below in the comment section. All right, we're getting started with the Dark Sylveon Celebrations box, and these actually are getting tougher to find. Fine, especially the Charizard one too, but I love the Dark Sylveon. It looks so sick. Such a throwback. Let's get it going here. We got the Dark Sylveon. We got the code card to go with that. We got a giant Dark Sylveon card as well. And then we're going to pull out these packs. We got Celebrations, more Celebrations, more Celebrations, Evolving Skies, which is a banger, more Celebrations, and we got Fusion Strike. All right, let's get it going. I'm just going to grab random packs here. We're going to start off with Fusion Strike. Let's see what we get. Thanks again to PokePD and Bella for sending this stuff over here for our first mystery box of the day. It's gonna get crazy today. I can feel it. I can feel it in my bones. You know what? I'm gonna make a I'm gonna make a bold claim here, and I'm gonna say that we're gonna pull the Celebrations Charizard. That's how confident I am right now today. I don't know why. Sometimes all it takes is a little bit of confidence. We got a Reshiram and a Flying Pikachu. And I forgot to mention, but I do have both um, YouTubers linked down below in the description. If you want to check them out and say what's up, go subscribe to them. All that good stuff. Show the love. We got Evolving Skies. Come on. All right, Evolving Skies. Now you show the love by giving us an all art out of the first pack of Evolving Skies. And we have Smeargle. Sorry, but how are they going to put a Smeargle not hollow in as a rare there? All right. Celebrations. Let's see if we can do it on. Ooh. Well, there's a Flying Pikachu in there. I know that. But there could be something else before it. It's a Zekrom and then the Flying Pikachu. I think it's a Flying Pikachu kind of day. We got the P It's literally the Pikachu good luck. The, the Pikachu plush that we have is bringing us the Pikachu luck. I mean, there's no other way around it. We got Cosmog, Xerneas, and a Soul Gap. How are you going to tell me that's not the Pikachu luck right there? I like how the hat is custom so Pikachu's ears can fit right through it. All right. Let's see what we got. Celebrations. We got the Dark Gyarados. Nice. And the Pikachu luck is back again. How can... That's ridiculous. Three Pikachu. All right, so check this out. This was in envelope number two. Fusion Strike, Evolving Skies, and Lost Origin. But these are the sleeved packs. So let's see how these turn out if I can get this one open. Come on. Come on, buddy. There we go. Okay, so code card out. We're going to go four from the back on this one. Let's see if we can get that big Gengar out of here. Simifor. After these two packs, we're going to move on and see what we got in our next envelope. All right, um, let's do Evolving Skies. This is our second pack of Evolving Skies. Did they reprint the sleeve packs? I actually don't know. Let's see. Oh, okay. That's a norm. That's a non-reprint. But it's got the black borders. Okay, come on. Let's go. Let's see if we can do it on this one. Something good in this one. Bobby Skies! The Algahala. I know we can do it with Lost Origin. I know we can do it with Lost Origin. Come on. Alright. Add to this pack. We're gonna move on to envelope number three. Let's see what we get. We're gonna go four. All right, ready? Come on. Lost Origin. Give me an Aerodactyl first pack. Let's go. Cascoon. Not hollow. Continuing, we have envelope number three. Okay. Let's see what we can do in envelope number three. Let's see what we got. Feels like packs. Oh, nice. We're going back to Sun and Moon Base, Crimson Invasion, 
And we got a cosmic eclipse. Let's go. All right, we're going to come back for you, envelope number four. I think that's actually the last. Yes, number four is the last one in here. Man, this is a lineup. We'll start with the base, then we'll move to the Crimson Invasion, and then we'll end it with cosmic eclipse here. All right, let's go. We're going to go four on these. So we have all Sun and Moon packs, which is pretty sick. Um, we got Golbat. We got Potion. Come on, baby. Let's go. Let's see what we can get into this one. Let's see what we can get. Cloyster. Where's our Pikachu? Good luck, Charmat. Come on. We need you, Pikachu. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, that's a bad sign. I'm actually going to go straight through this one. I'm going to go straight through this one. Yep. Okay, not hollow that one. But here we have Cosmic Eclipse, which is probably the coolest pack I feel like that we're opening so far t today. Oh, no. The green code card is going to do us like that. No! A Swoobat non hollow. Breaking into our final envelope is number four and it looks like we have four shining fates booster packs and i actually missed it but there is a note in here and it says the second rule of this is if we pull the shiny charizard which i really need to pull we can keep it okay that's fair that's fair all right we got our good luck pikachu is that all it's gonna take to pull this charizard i've opened so many packs of this set if we could just get it out of one of these random four that would be beyond insane let's see if we could do it though come on we got horsey Rowlet, Eevee, Zarud? You never know. It only takes one booster pack. It only takes one booster pack to make something happen here. But after these packs, we're going to see what's in our next mystery box. More Peko, Katnia, Spinarak, and a Decidueye Hollow. Come on, two more packs. The last one has the Charizard artwork on it. The last one has the Charizard artwork on it. Can we do it with Shining Fates? Rusted Sword, Ball Guy is kind of creepy, but it is what it is. Horsey, Grookey. Celebi! But now it all comes down to one final pack here for Shining Fates. It always comes down to one final pack for Shining Fates for me. But hey, it is what it is. Let's see if we can do it on one, maybe. All right. Our final pack here, and then we're moving into the next box. We have a Zarud. Our next mystery box is from the one and only Poketube Tyler, who actually sent us one before, and he said that he didn't like the pulls that we got, which is understandable because it wasn't super crazy, which is it's fine. It's the thought that counts, right? You never know what you're going to get. But he wants to do it bigger and better. And oh my god, right on the top, we do have my boy, dude, right to top. Oh my god, as a Funko Pop. Dude, that's freaking nuts. I always wanted my own Rattata, and now we have one. And oh my gosh, we got a lot of envelopes in here. Okay, this one says open first, so let's go ahead and open this one up first. Uh, there we go. Okay, so our first one, it looks like, ooh, nice. We have four packs, five packs, I'm sorry. Five packs of Silver Tempest. And you know what? Since we're here, since we're here already, we might as well see what's in the second one as well. All right. Envelope two. It looks like... Ooh, 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 ooh. We got a nice little selection here. Okay, we got a bunch of stuff. Look at this nice selection of packs here. Okay. We're just going to start with Silver Tempest, see what we can do. Can we get some big pulls out of these packs? Let's see what we got. PokeTube Tyler. Let's see, let's see. We got Relicant, Halucha. Look at the mark. Krogunk and a Victini. So the last time, I think it was a Best Buy employee that picked the packs out. And uh, I don't know what happened, but yeah, they just, I don't know. They, I don't think they had like a ton of pulls, but it is, you know, it's just the luck of things. With Sometimes you get lucky, sometimes you're not lucky. Drowsy, Growlithe, Mischievous, Whalmer, and a Keldeo. Let's see if we can get it on these ones. All right. Now, we do have another <laughs> we do have another chance with, uh, with uh, Shining Fates, though. I see we got two Shining Fates back there. Looks like we got Brilliant Stars, Astral Rains back there as well. So you never know. Again, it just takes one just takes one booster back. Come on, Silver Tempest? Ports on Silver Tempest are pretty nice. I mean, you could get... Ooh, we got a shiny. Okay, we got a, our first hit. It's a shiny. Yeah, there's so many different things you get from Silver Tempest. Uh, maybe the Alt Art Lugia? Just saying. Just going to throw it out there. That's a white code card. So the best we could probably do on this one would be a Trainer Gap. A Trainer Gallery or a shiny. Or two of the same shiny back to back. What is happening? I had that happen the other day. Two of the same cards back to back. I don't understand. Okay, let's go, let's go. Valtoy, Gudra. All right, so we're moving in Astral Radiance. That's a good sign. We got a good code card. You know what? We're gonna go like this. Let's see what that last card is. Come on, Astral. Astral Radiance, bring us the good Scyther. Basculins. Ooh, there we go, okay. Nice, we got our first V-Star of the day. It's about time our luck started turning around here. All right, why is this pack just like turning into nothing? Oh, ooh, that's a good sign. I, the packs, the, the code cards, they, they put them in different directions. Like, depending on the print run, they just keep changing it up on me. And I don't know. I never know which way to. 
Oh! Oh, dude! Nice! Let's go! That's just one pull, though. We could have something behind it. Oh, we do! <laughs> nice! What a pack, man. This is, like, absolutely one of my favorite cards from this set. And then from the trainer gallery, it might just be my favorite, or at least top three. All right, the luck is back. Let's use it on some of this Shining Fates now. Let's use it on some of this Shining Fates now. Come on. Shining Fates, I've never been lucky enough to pull that Charizard. And we've definitely been on some crazy adventures trying to pull that Charizard. A lot of crazy adventures, I will say. Kyogre, amazing rare. Nice. All right. It, said, it always comes down to the last Shining Fates booster pack. And this one's the Charizard. Okay, here we go. Four on this one. Shining Fates. What do you got for us this time? Floatzel, Rotom, Coughing, Shinx, Rookie, Trapage, Shadma, Morpeko. Nope, it just doesn't want to give me anything. But there's still more in the box, so let's go check it out. All right, so we have Envelope 3. Let's see what we got in this one now. Oh, it's a bunch of packs. Okay. Oh, Sun and Moon. Oh, my God. And we used to have like, the same, some of the same Sun and Moon packs as the last one. Sun and Moon Base, Crimson Invasion, Guardians Rising. We got Lost Thunder and Burning Shadows. Let's freaking go. Okay. So, you know what? We might as well move on to the fourth one. And we got Custom Pokies Tube Tyler pack here. Okay. This one's a custom pack. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, 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 okay, we'll save this one. I don't know what this could be, but we'll try and check that out. Right, we're starting off with some of these Sun and Moon packs here. We got base set. We'll do them right to left here. Let's see what we could do. Okay. Man, we got, we got another shot at Sun and Moon today. <laughs> it's interesting. I wasn't expecting to get the... Because, yeah, we had some of these Sun and Moon packs in the last uh, mystery box, which is kind of crazy because these don't, like... You can't pick these up in stores. Oh, my God. Yo, let's go. What's with the evolutions today? That's fire. Espeon GX Full Art? Oh my god, yo. Dude, it's an evolution kind of day. A Pikachu and an evolution kind of day. Look how off-center this code card is. Uh, what's this, Crimson Invasion? Oh my god, okay, okay. Yo, it's heating up now. It's heating up, so I just gotta wait a little bit. We got Carol Blast, Swablu. Execute, Swablu. Oh my god, what's happening? Dude, two full RTXs in a row. We're on fire right now. We're on fire right now. Let's go three for three. Come on. Let's go three for three. Here we go. Three for three. Three for three. Man, those are some good pulls. These are off center. Quite a bit, actually. Delibird, Trubbish, Machop, Flexing. Don't flex on me. Vanilla. All right, so check it out. You know what? Uh, yeah, we'll do Lost Thunder next, and then we'll end it with Burn. I will literally pass out if we pull Rainbow Charizard from Burning Shadows. I will actually pass out. I will actually pass out. Okay, Lost Thunder is sick, too, because you can get that Lugia, right? Lugia is in this one, I think. And Tyranitar, right? Bruxish or Wobbuffet. All right, all right, I can't believe we're opening this up. But we're opening a Burning Shadows pack up, and it's always crazy because you always have that shot. I know it's like a slim to none chance, but you always have that shot. For the crazy. We got Charmander. Ooh, Heracross. All right, so next up we have this custom pack, which it looks like on the front we have Water Energy, but that's actually 2013, which is pretty old. What do we have here? Ooh, ooh, first edition Gorbis, Japanese from 2004? Oh my God, that's actually pretty sick. Wait, what else do we got in here? We have... Oh my god, a dugong? What set? I'm sorry, I don't know exactly what set this is from, but it looks so amazing. This must be an old EX set, but... Oh my god, the Tangrowth too? Yo, these are fire! 2009? Oh my god, they're from like all different generations. 2007? Electivire? Dude, the Metagross first edition? Diamond and Pearl? Blaziken? Yo, these are actually really, really cool. Oh my god, Infernape! Lucario, dude, what? These are so sick. Oh my god, and ended it with some fire? Bro, you weren't kidding about this one. No way, this is a Charizard Japanese Expedition First Edition E-Series. Back to the box, and this says open fifth vintage, oh my god, vintage packs. English, Spanish, Chinese, Portuguese. Yo, okay. And this isn't even the last one. This isn't even the last one. Okay, what do we have? Yo, yo, no. I can already tell you, this is Ruby and Sapphire. No shot. What? What else is in here? Oh my God. Power Keepers, right? What else do we have? Oh wait, no, Legend Maker. This is Chinese Legend Maker. This is, oh, uh, oh, Legendary Treasures? Wait, what? <laughs> this is, this one's English. Hot Gold Soul Silver. 
And the Diamond of Pearl base. Oh my god, dude, you're insane. Come on now. Come on now. Come on now. This is a little too crazy. Are you kidding me? These are all old school packs. Some in English, some in different languages. Uh, yo, what? Ruby and Sapphire? There's only, this is really thin. I think there's only a few packs in, a few cards in them. Uh, in, in certain languages. Oh my god, but this is, this is EX era. Wurmple. Flipper. And a Cascoon. Look at this, look at this, like, look at this. This is like, ridiculous at this point. These are so old. Gosh, okay, Chinese Legend Maker now. And again, there's only like five cards in this pack. But let's see what we get. Oh my gosh. Machop! Alright, not flexing on us this time. Not this time. You know what? I'm gonna save this this is in English, right? Yes, this is hundred percent English. I'm gonna save this one for last. Uh let's go Hark Old Soul Silver now. Hark Old Soul Silver base. We opened a box of these one time actually. And um not the Ruby Sapphire, but we did the uh, Legend Maker before. Diamond and Pearl base we did not do, I don't think. Cyndaquil, Whooper. There's some back there. Giraffe, Rayquivit, and the Legend card. <laughs> no shot. Oh my God, the craziest fool so far today. Lugia, Legend card. Yo, this cannot be real life. Out of what pack? Look at this thing. This is one of two pieces. Oh my gosh, yo, what is happening? We're getting so many different generations here. We have Diamond and Pearl base now. Diamond and Pearl base now. Same thing though, only a, a handful of cards per pack. But dude, you just saw that out of one pack of that. Starly, Cascoon, and Pokeball. All right, all right, all right, all right. we saved this one. Legendary Treasures. You guys have seen Legendary Treasures get open before. It can be ridiculous, but this is 2013, 10 years ago. Watch this. Legendary Treasures never ever failed us. I don't think I've ever had Legendary Treasures fail us. It's just so ridiculous. It's not, it's just, oh, I don't even think I do a pack trick on these because they're that crazy. They just put so many hits in these things. All right, let's see what we could do though. Piplop, Solosis. Ready, ready, ready? Ooh, Zatu. Okay, hopefully I didn't jinx us. I didn't jinx us! I <laughs> this is like the craziest thing ever. Oh my God, yo, this might be the best pool in this entire set. The Mew EX, and then we have an Ursaring Radiant card right behind it, and a Charmeleon. Bro, what the heck? Oh, man. Like, I gotta say, out of this set, out of the main part of the set, or the Radiant Collection part of the set, I should say, the Mew EX is easily one of the best, if not the best card you could actually get from the entire set. It's just, it's insane. I gotta put this in a sleeve, but just so you guys know, this card in the 10 is, is worth like 500 bucks, like all day. It's actually kind of mind blowing. I told y'all, for those of you who didn't believe me, Legendary Treasures never fails us ever. But let's go see what the last envelope is in our mystery box. And our last envelope here looks like, woo! <laughs> we got a giant stack of graded cards here, starting with the Hisuian Samurai. So it looks like this is 10, 10, 10, and a 9, 5, but overall gem mid 10. That's sick. We got the Holo EX from Breakpoint. Let's freaking go. That's an older X and Y 2016. We got the Charizard on the label. Interesting. We got a Magneton 1997 base set Hollow Magneton in a nine. There's subgrades on here as well. We have, oh man, let's go. We got the Marshadow and Machamp GX card with the overall 10. That's solid. And then ended it with a 6.5 Chansey from base set. Looks like Pikachu brought us the luck today. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to smash the like button on your way out. If you watch more content, click on one of the two videos at the top there. Hit that subscribe button as well. And as always, I hope you have a great day. And I will see you on the next one.